We are back on Bar Bars, guys. Our guest today, very, very talented actor. You, of course, know him from the world of wrestling as well. His brand new film is called Ferdinand. It's in UK cinemas December 11th. Ladies and gentlemen, John Cena's in the building. Thank Here you. we go, sir. Uh, well, well, I always try for you, sir. But welcome back to the UK for Thank a start. You. It's Thank really you. lovely to see you. Um, as you can tell, we're already sporting the headgear yes. relevant to the film, which yes. is a wonderful it's thing. And I'm delighted. Proud. You've brought us some Christmas gifts I as did. well, John. I did. I, I'm kind of stunned by this. This is, this is no nonsense. These actually got given to us by John. John Cena, yes. two seconds ago. Do you yeah. know what these are, by the yes, way? Yes, I do. He does oh, know what these are. This is good. This is professional. Shall we open them up now? Yeah, yeah. Let's open it up. All right, okay. Unwrap, unwrap. Okay. I'll tell you what, while we're unwrapping, why don't you tell us what the film's about for people who First haven't seen all, it yet? First of all, that is something everyone needs, and they don't know it until they get it. So okay. I think you'll all appreciate that. Oh, God, I'm excited. Oh, oh yes. Wow. Oh, I'm very excited. It's film related. Yes. It's beautiful. So we all have a place to hang our heads, and we all have, Wonderful. like, tables, and mm -hmm. you all need to put a book on a table. It's very true. Yeah. Wow. God, this is, this is a conversation starter on the yeah, coffee table. It really really is because and it was so much fun this film pretty amazing on the inside it shows the creation all the animation and the work that goes into making the movie John I wish we'd brought a gift for you mate I wish I feel the embarrassed now the gift of conversation now. are you kidding me guys <laughs> <laughs> this is great it's a beautiful great. thing oh amazing we did genuinely have a really really nice time at the film man it's such yeah. a beautiful it's little yeah. family movie. film it and really really is family film is a great way to describe it absolutely it's one of those films that's going to resonate with audiences young and old so I it agree. is a great time oh amazing so how did you get into character playing further down the ball let's be honest they just want me to be myself I think the greatest thing about Ferdinand is through his big, larger-than-life muscular frame is an endearing, caring, lovable beast inside. Yeah. Like, and that, that was easy for me, man. Oh, I just it, wanted me to be myself. It's so nice. It is so nice. And you say that as well. The, the, one of the lovely messages that comes through is uh, when, obviously, it gets to the end with all the bullfighting and everything, yeah. and it's sort of like actually about being yourself and everything. You know, um, Where did that kind of message come from? Are you an animal lover, I should ask, I suppose? Well, the, the, the book is over 80 years old. Oh, wow. So it's mm. literally, this is a tale that's... Uh, resonated with generation after generation nice. and it's when you read the short story it's amazing for a book that was published and pressed in 1929 how like progressive it was yeah it really how, is uh, how bold the statement was and how the message still to this day rings very true no it really really yeah, is you were thinking I about really well. agree with that because when I was watching it I was thinking Ferdinand kind of like re there's almost not to get too deep about it but no it no kind it's, of and like, that's what's great about the movie you take so much away and you, yeah. can, you can have conversations like exactly. this so please like let's he, go he let's of, go deep <laughs> come on let's yeah, do it but it defies a gender stereotype and a toxic masculinity yeah. and I kind of was thinking you know particularly guys you've come from the wrestling world you know how important is is it that there are role models for young kids out there that kind of you know show a bit more heart and a bit more mm. in touch with their feelings well it's, it's good boys. that you it's good that you say that anybody who's familiar and there we have so many uh wwe fans in the uk mm -hmm. anybody who's familiar with my uh wwe personality they know that i deal with a fair share of adversity and mm. not just from the people i'm in the ring with the audience itself there's half of the audience that at the top of their lungs they say let's go cena and the other half says cena sucks <laughs> and, and this is a real thing That's and true. genuinely there's a large group of uh, critical influence that wants me to change who I am mm. and I realize uh, over the years if I change they're going to figure something else to pick on me about so I'm not yeah. going to please them and I'm going to turn my back on the people I care about the people that support me mm -hmm. so I don't and I deal with adversity just like Ferdinand yeah. is being bullied by all the other bulls to yeah. be like you're this you stand up for yourself and you say no I'm not so mm. you're, I, I really was honored to be able to take essentially what I've been known for for 15 years and translate it into a family film. Because yeah. we, we, mm -hmm. we have so, uh, such a large global family audience in WWE, and this sends the same message that I try to send yeah. on a weekly basis, and now you have it in a, a beautiful universe. Amazing. God, it really is that deep. It, it is, really is. It? There's no, so many beautiful cool. scenes and, all and the way I, through I it. I think that everybody leaving the theater will have something like that to talk about. There's so many different journeys for all the characters, yeah. and I truly believe in this movie there is no villain mm -hmm. because everyone goes through a wonderful journey. And at the end, you know, whether you're a young audience member or an old audience member, you'll be able to talk to something. You can have a grown-up conversation about mm -hmm. BBC, and you can uh, young people can have a conversation, yeah. and young and old can have a conversation. Sure. And it's, a, it's a very powerful movie in that regard. Oh, beautiful. Nice. Beautiful stuff. So in terms of acting, you're known for a lot of comedy. We've had Sisters, great, Trainwreck, amazing, yeah. and Ferdinand, obviously, is brilliant. Um, but so are, like, The Rock and Dave Bautista as well. What is it about wrestling that prepares you guys for, like, comedy roles like it's, that? Well, it's not. It's, it's storytelling, and I think mm -hmm. anyone who's had long-term sustained success in the WWE that has come with its share of failure mm -hmm. and its share of embarrassing moments <laughs> because you're not always painted as the hero. Oftentimes you have to put your life out there and look silly. And I think a lot of comedy is being able to laugh 
at your hardships. Mm -hmm. That's what a lot of, that's what resonates with a lot of audience. So I just think WWE prepares you for every possible situation in life as a performer, and it allows you to not take yourself so seriously. Very true. Very true. Very and you've worked with uh, like opposite a lot of um, very funny ladies as well. So we've got a question. Uh, if you had to spend 24 hours trapped in a lift <laughs> with <laughs> Tina Fey, Amy Schumer, or Kate McKinnon, who would you choose? That's, oh, that's so tough. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I... I, Kate does so well with developing characters. Yeah, I kind yeah. of feel like I'd be in the lift with fifty different people. <laughs> that, yes. So I think that's a great. That's, you, that's, that's a very yeah. good if answer. I ever got tired of one personality, she could just do it. <laughs> Woman of a thousand voices, she really answer. is. Uh, John, it's so nice to see you, man. Ferdinand is in cinemas December eleventh. Please, please, please do go and see it. Brilliant family film for Thank Christmas. Thank you guys for the time John's, and the probing. Oh, mate, any probing, <laughs> anytime, my friend. John Cena, everybody, there he is.